Hello. I'm feeling my sound for this is really quiet. We're live, by the way. Hell yeah. I want chat to tell me if my volume's okay. And by chat, I mean Polly. <laughs> it's good on my end. Okay. Are we supposed to hear things right now? Dude, Randy just messaged me. He's asking if we're okay playing. Uh-oh. She what? took too long. Hello. When can I invite you guys? Uh, um, you make a lobby. So did I fuck up? And yeah, yeah, you made a game. You didn't make a multiplayer. You made a single player game. <gasps> Oops. Mermaid's logic says louder, Rashida. Louder, Regina. I'm gonna increase it on my end. Okay. And a whisper of other mics. Oh, that would make sense like that you go in multiplayer. Duh. Testing. Check, check. Oh, yeah. Are you loading it up, Richie? I'm already in the main screen. I just got your invite. Okay. I sent invites. Can you send another one? No. Okay. Uh, I'm going to need to send another one because your invite isn't an invite. It's just telling you. It just says, we're yeah. I don't know what. I'm clicking the plus and then your name. Press, um, shift tab. You press shift tab. <laughs> okay. Okay, and then on the bottom hot bar do you see like the two people yeah friends yep you're gonna click on that one and then you're gonna right click on our names and uh click invite not seeing it invite to watch uh launch game watch game store page community hub Remove as red. Salad. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. Here, go, um, press shift tab again. Go back to the game. Oops. I accidentally invited Mary. I really hope they don't join. I don't want to confuse them. So weird. Oops. Do, Tyler, are you able to increase your mic volume? <laughs> okay, hold on. Uno mas. Is that better? Check one, two. Could be a little louder. A little All right. Louder. So I hit the multiplayer. We're online. I hit create. Yes, 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 yes. Hell yeah, Arthur. You know what it's about. <laughs> okay. And then I invite. Oh, I think I got it this time.
Shut up for Richard. Is it not working? No, I don't know why. Why does it hate me, Tyler? Hmm. Okay, you make it. <laughs> you want me to make it? Yes. I don't know why, but it's not working. I don't think Tyler and I are speed friends. That can be remedied. A bald capybara. Is my mic still low, chat? I'm like right up to it. Also, Tyler, my friend code's in the general voice chat. <laughs> That's Bando. He, he my boyfriend. Like, he has a screaming Simon. Oh, wait, hold on. I just realized you guys can't see. His profile is Simon screaming. I'm in a submarine. Mine's Bean screaming. A submarine? Who's the bald capybara? <laughs> Richard! Richard! Richard made it in. Richard. We're gonna have a, a soda. A soda. What kind of soda are you drinking? Vanilla Coke. I'm very tempted to put liquor in it. Specifically rum. Yes. Just gotta ready up. Keeps unreadying me. I'm done. Oh wait, should we skip this? Cause this might be chat's first no. time. Yeah, we should watch. Okay. I'm gonna close that. Then you can see. Let's force them to watch the worm. There's Lysel. You know what's weird? Hmm. I just thought that <laughs> I want to paint his nails. He has so much real estate. Um, if you're very squeamish about worms going into orifices, um, click away. Yeah, click away now. Don't watch. <laughs> I just realized the worm is hairy. Well, 
Well, my mic's all the way up, chat, so... So get ready. Yeah. Icky. All right, the worm's gone. You can join back in now. Who are you? I'm a man. I'm gonna reset the tutorials. Turn that back on. Let me see if I can adjust. Hmm. Can you guys hear me? Yeah. yeah. Very faintly. No, I'm not. It's always faintly. Yeah, there's not really much as far as, like, settings go. Okay. Hey, I'm doing wood, half-elf, um, rogue, and charlatan. So I'm going to be the stealth. Nice. Build. Okay. I like it. But I'm not going to be very strong, unfortunately. Seeing if I can find. Arthur says you sound better now. Hello, Mary. Hell yeah. She do got a uh, Grinch nose. So that does not work. All right, I will, I'll have to fix that later. Okay. All right. Oh, wait, let's do. You said you're elf? Half elf. Half, half elf. elf. Okay. I think I'm gonna do elf, like full elf. Because I know they have a profinity for magic. think investigation or insight would be a better proficiency. Mm. Maybe investigation. Okay. <laughs> Actually, I think I can have both. Because I mm -hmm. don't... Hmm. 
What helps open locks? Is it sleight of hand? Yeah. And is it sleight of hand or is that dexterity? Um, oh wait, that would be though. dexterity still. Never mind. I'm yeah. dumb. <laughs> Well, I won't have acrobatics, but I'll have both investigation. Invest. Sorry, I'll have investigation, insight, perception, and persuasion. I like that. Okay, what druid would be fun sometime? Hello, silly munchkins. All right. Let's see what I want. Definitely magic missile. Uh, yeah. I think I'm gonna do Draconic Bloodline. Uh, what's a good background for sorcerer? That'd be sage. Probably. I was thinking sage. What is a lapis stud muffin? Oh, the earring? You want me to be goth, I silly? I can do that. Huh? Silly Munchkins wants me to be goth. Okay. I support it. I'm also goth. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. I think I'm goth, but I'm actually emo. What'd you go with? Okay. Me? What in... Uh, you what like, next? oh my god. Uh, race for hmm. you guys. What was uh, that? Well, Tyler and Richard. I'm a deepling. Nice. Went with a deep gnome player. Let's hope the locals are friendly. Hells, be wary. This place is trapped. I want the deep lady voice. I'm trying to remember which face looked like mine. Not those. Not that. Q. 
can't remember. Was it the regular face? Need a pale lady. Why is that so? Oh, I could be purple. Hello, Vepistine. Head looks so big. I feel like it was this one. Make I think I am done. What color hair should I do? Um, well, if you're, if you're gonna go goth, I feel like it's gotta be black hair, right? It doesn't have to be. It's different. You can do black and green. Black and green? But probably black and Her style's so cute, and I wish I could pull, like, this off. I think I could. I feel like the bangs always look so weird in this. <laughs> There's, like, some funny hair options in here. It's like a big... That's like what my hair looks like sometimes. The immortality. But like, or like that, yeah. Really poofy, though. It would be a lot frizzier. Dude, I could be Legolas. Sorry. Nesta. What do you? The Ariana Grande one. <laughs>
That's a man. Interesting. Yeah, the chat will probably be delayed. I'm not going to have a last name. I just want to be like... What did I do? Oh. Okay. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> Got me an Nanaimo bar. I'm excited. Oh, we skipped. Okay. I, I'm sorry. That's my bad. Oh. What the fuck, Tyler? I was trying to change my setting. Uh-huh. Men. Boo. Big fumble. <laughs> that was a, I was just about to say how amazing a cutscene that was. It was sweet. It, it only gets better. You missed the cutscene. Now part. they'll never see it. Yep. Sorry. Think ultimate destruction, then uh, dragons show up and start attacking the ship. Mm -hmm. and, and the ship itself is an octopusy. Yes. Just wait, there's a lot of rectums.
You're right, Pollyanna. <clears throat> My head. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. Hey, yo. Don't touch it. The casing is fragile. The slightest touch could cause it to crumble. I want it to crumble, though. What happens if you leave it? Um, probably nothing. Okay. I mean, if you don't do anything. Tyler? Are you Shadow Heart but a man? Um. <laughs> with a bad haircut? I started with Farquaad. I was going for Farquaad and then it just looked like Shadow Heart. I was like, okay, I'm just going to stick with it. Should have done like Shadow Quad. Alright, let's go through the shrinkter. There's nothing else to loot in here, is there? No. Okay. Sphincter time. Images of goblins, their habits and histories flash into your mind. The schematic of a nautiloid flashes into your mind. Nerves, sinews. Hey, I want to oh touch gosh, the brain. They left without us. Right back culture. down here. know him. Oh, there is a yes. lot of gore. You've come to save us from this place. Just fair warning. Quivers in expectation. Yeah, at least in the first part. Please. Days. Before they return. They return. You're so purple. Remove us from this body, from this case. Free us, please. Oh no. Buddy, he fights for you. Oh god. Oh, Richard, you look so cool. The brain lifts from the skull. But you notice an opportunity. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient, should it prove a threat. I like the white tattoos. Mm-hmm. Me too. Inspired. Um, there's a lot of free nudity. Friend. The creature pauses, listening. Something behind it is catch up, yes. Seizes in recognition. We must go to the helm. At the helm, we all need it. To the helm we go. We are going to the helm. Oh, I love us. Oh my god. Yeah, I broke his brain. Do you guys see him on his, uh, bed? Alright. Sorry, Regina. Yeah. yeah. Oh. The brain is up here with me too, you guys. Why would that be <laughs> Never let a Richard dry. Never let a Richard dry. <laughs> I chose to be giant so I couldn't get pushed around. 
Visions rush past. A dragon swing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh. <sighs> My head. What is this? Tyler. You, you need to change your fucking appearance right now. You are no sword. Flack is blessed. What do you this mean? Day. Together, we might survive. He looks great. Who am I? I hate Your it. Only chance of survival. I fucking hate it. We, within days, we will be gay. Mind flayers. You're perfect the way you are. We can do nothing until we escape. First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. We will address the matter of a cure for this infection once we reach the material plane. So, the octopusy put um, a worm in each of our brains. Did you just say the octopusy? That's what we're calling them. Oh, I wasn't there for that. <laughs> oh. I am fury. I am death. Oh, we still get lays up. On the move. What's he got? Oh. Yeah, we we you never can hear Richard, so that's fine. All right, Richard, we're, we're getting the sword this time. Yeah. Surprisingly adequate work, team. GG's. To the helm. Very well. Let's see what this does. Oh, Lord. I feel better. Ship won't be able to take another dragon attack. We need to get out before it's too late. <clears throat> healing thing in this one? Um, I, I have two healing potions. I do too, but... Okay, cool, 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 cool. Mind flayer machine. Better watch what I touch. I wanna push the buttons. Don't push the buttons. But I can't loot them like this. You! Get me out of this damn thing! We have no time for stragglers. Let's go, let's go. Hey yo! Um, yes, it does. Warding ruins. You feel <sighs> drawing energy from the console near to the pod. Are you satisfied? We need to go. Hurry! Am hey. I going to hit the socket? Okay. I want to touch it. Touch Whatever it. fits in that socket must I think you might be able to use magic. Yeah. The console appears if, if I uh, get the roll. 
the console hum. It does to life. get less yucky poly anarchy. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. The pulsing glow and organic lines of the device make it seem more like a beating heart than a machine. Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. There's a high authority. ponytail. Wait, I did it? No, I did mm -hmm. it. One of you did it. What the fuck, Richard? I, I'm i sorry, I'm big strong. He just does boy. his own thing. I mean, you were already. I was like out. one second away from opening it. What's in this sphincter? Or do we have to go into this sphincter? Where are you trying to go? Uh. How many hosts of these gay infect dazed woman is trapped inside the pod? She doesn't notice you. Let's have a look. Oh, a chest. This might have all those controls next to the pod. Another brain. I wanna push. Wait, this we don't get shadow no, because we have a full party. As you place your hand on the pod, yeah, you, you hear said, something. A presence connected yeah. to the oh, pod, no. commanding the person inside oh. to change. She'll still be, like, added to camp. She just won't be party. Char, changed at the pull of a lever. How? If we are not purified, this may be our fate. Will and preserve me. That cannot be our fate. Another day, another sphincter. Baldur's Gate is the uh, name of a city. Sphincter! Sphincter! Once inside, do as I say. She's so breathy. Moving in. Get ready. I'll I'm give ready. it a shot. Sphincter this bitch. Eye on the prize, guys. Eye on the prize. Sphincters. <laughs> deal with the geek after we escape connect the nerves nerves we will connect them oh brain you're so cute <laughs> we need to get out of here now oh rashida you got your hair cut in here i did you mean just because i have sh i chose short hair isn't that your haircut is that your 
Yeah, it's no, pretty close. Yeah. It's a little longer now. Yeah. Oh. I'm just going off your Discord. Um, do you have any, uh, like, flaming arrows, alchemist fire, anything like that? Sorry, I just burped. Uh, let me Still see. on my seat. No. I have a crossbow. Okay. And a short bow. Okay. Well, I have grease bottles for mm. whenever... Oh, I have a fire bolt. Okay. So, I can throw a grease bottle then. Yeah, yeah. I also have a thing called Produce Flame. Alright. I'm gonna throw it, um, right... Maybe at the big beast here. No, oh, it's already on fire. Okay. Yeah, it's Lit. caught on fire from the flames in front of you. Split these intruders on my God damn. Slow down. Make way. This you is Can you move out of the way a little bit? Where do I go from here? Well, so much for peace. Everybody is like blocking the one side, and I have to walk through the fire to get over there. I can't move at all. Uh, can you jump? Oh, yeah. Yes, this is the end, basically. His sword. Taking position. Thanks. Richard. It's fucking rude. Best be on my way. Oh. Like, not even really a quarter 
the way dead. Yeah. What'd you call her? That mistake a second time. Have a nice night, Arthur. Her name's Lazelle. What I said. No. If this ship hits the ground, we're dead. If this ship hits the ground, we're dead. Hell yeah. I need to try and push him. <laughs> oh jeez. You did a little, yeah. Well, your spine is mine. Your spine? <laughs> Survival is all that matters. Dude, the mind player's about to die. Can one of you set that grease on fire? Yes. I'm just nervous because once he kills the mind flayer, we're kind of fucked. Yeah, we'll probably have to reload. Shit. No, we're not reloading. I've 
got a healing potion I can throw at the mind flare if you really want me to. I just threw one at the mind flare. Do you want me to do another? Uh, if you want to. Another. I just pushed the big guy into the fire, so hopefully we get some damage over there. Oh god. I don't think we're gonna get it, guys. We have literally three turns to do 80, 84 damage. Well, he's in the fire. Seriously? Oh, fuck. Very well. Seriously? I do not. Have what? The command spell. No choice but to keep going. No. Fuck. We're kind of screwed. Screwed. Are you kidding me? Victory awaits. No, it doesn't, Lisa. <laughs> Good night, Mermaid's Logic. He's almost dead. Yeah, right? I just I just want you to get to the thing, and then once we are like, oh, we can't get him, then hit the responder. But doesn't that, like, set off right? the cutscene? The cutscene's already been set off. That's why the minions are here. 
I don't have a ranged weapon. Oh. Uh, whoever's got ranged mm -hmm. abilities, he should head towards. Okay. Uh, that would be me. You or Tyler. Okay. And Lazel. Not Lazel. I just didn't have, it wasn't my turn anymore, so I couldn't move. About him. Now they can fly. Kill them your spine is mine. You're dead. <laughs> Who died? I died? Yep. Uh -oh. <sighs> Thanks, Tyler. Good night, silly munchkins. Well, oh no. Okay. Should we go back? Oh, this was a mess. Go back and save? And do this no. whole fight over again? Yeah. No. But, sword. It's no. not that important. I mean, there's better. There's a, I mean, this is the good sword in the beginning, but there's better swords you can get later on. But, flaming sword. It's not meant to be, Marin. Send us away. Send us yeah. away. Yeah. The Helm's alien transponder. You made it in time. Sorry, that's my polish bottle squeaking. 
What are you using today? Um, aquafoil and frost light. That's what you did last time. Yeah. If it, it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah, I'm also sad about them retiring. So you're going to use them up faster? I have new ones coming, too. Oh, okay. Yeah. Plus, they were already out and right next to me. is so cool. Mm -hmm. You can sleep with that lady. What is your character, Tyler? <laughs> he kind of looks like Sea Dog Bigger doing Shadow Heart God Boy. Oh my god. Rude. <laughs> As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. The chaos of the crash site confuses the landscape. You'll need to find a settlement or landmark, and you'll need to do it quickly. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. Can't slow down. Gonna loot, 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 gonna loot, 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 gonna loot, gonna loot, gonna loot, loot, loot. loot. I remember the ship. I remember falling. The nothing. No, I don't recognize this place. But anything's an improvement on where we just came from. First things first, we need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. You might want to reconsider calling her a friend. Looks like she ran off without us. Wait! Charging off by yourself sounds like a fine way to get killed. We need each other, and we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. You seem overburdened with hangers-on already. Okay, then why did you offer? Fine. But don't delay. <laughs> that was amazing. What did you do, <laughs> Tyler? I pushed Richard. Oh my god. Don't start. Did you guys loot everything? Yeah. Bastards.
Are we going in or? Uh, I opened this left wing up real quick. Oh yeah. I'm gonna try opening this door. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna go to the sigil first. <laughs> Bastard. Where's the sigil that Gale's at? Can we chop his arm off? No, we can't chop his arm off. And what? uh I hate Gale. Also okay. hate Gale. I mean, we can still what, Gale why do you it's Why do you guys hate? Oh, I mean, yeah. Just it just really rips into the economy of my wallet. <laughs> Eats me out of house and home. <laughs> Jean, this. I'm gonna pick this lock, okay? Hell yeah. Let's do that. I failed. I seen that. Tyler, don't do it, dude. I'll throw this flame at you. Does anyone have any more uh, thieves tools? You asked for it, Tyler. I'm gonna throw this flame I at you. I do now. not. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I don't. I'll send it to you. Where are we going? Into the store. Whoa. Hopefully. Are. Are you kidding me? Don't speak about it. What? I see that. We're gonna put more bark wad. <laughs> <laughs> Are we gonna go this way then? Yeah. <laughs> Better stay back. One strike could be lethal. How did you, what? How did you hey. get those birds? Back then. Um, I think I have high. Is it? Dexterity that lets you go first? Uh, I'm not sure. It's. I, wish I don't know what the modifier is it. for. I think it is Dex. Okay, well, I don't have any ranged weapons yet, so. Do you need me to send you a bow? Do you have multiple? Yeah. Yeah, if you do. You chose the wrong man to fix.
So what'd you guys do today? Work. Yeah, how'd that go? It's been dead because of the snow. It's pretty boring. So what do you do on days where you don't get as many... Do you still have tasks? Yeah. We just do like prep work, so like cutting vegetables, cutting chicken, making things, like I made Alfredo today. Is that a regular part of the menu or is that? That's a regular, yes. Something good here, I hope. Are you doing anything? Uh, what like what are your specials this week? Balls. Balls. What's inside? Hella balls. Like the meatballs. Yeah. Meatball subs, uh, and then a meatball appetizer with like a ricotta. Nice. And balsamic glaze. Quite delightful. Where are you guys going? There's a chest here. Did anyone open it yet? I opened the one up top on the little ledge. Yeah. And yeah, I got that one. Guy? Yeah. Excuse me? It better be Gale, because... Asterian? Asterian's mine. Score. Dumbass. <laughs> Not a sound. Not if you want to keep that darling neck... Now. I saw you on the ship, didn't I? Nod. Where did Richard go? Silk in an alloy. Tyler? Splendid. And now you're going to tell me exactly what you and those tentacle freaks did to me. Don't lie to me. I... Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. Uh, what was that? What's going on? You're not one of them. They took you. Just the same as me. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. <laughs> A kindred spirit. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Tyler? What? Don't take my mans. I I don't know what you're talking about. Don't A take pleasure. my mans. So, do you know anything about Oh, you're these sleeping worms? on the couch. <laughs> I suppose it's not exactly common knowledge. You know these what? You know what? You can have him, but I'm me. taking Carla. Now, what to do about it? Excuse me? That's my lady. Oh, well then I'm definitely taking her. I thought Shadowheart was your lady. Tempting, but your party seems a little uh, crowded right now. 
I like to have no. space. Shadow Heart's a bitch. I was ready to what? go this alone. Shadow Heart's kind of a bitch. Isn't a bad idea. She's nice. Safety in numbers, after all. And I hate to turn down an invitation. I also haven't gotten very far in the game. My man's. Seems like a good moment to talk. I'll come back. Do you keep trying to steal no. her little artifact? No. So I can see her being a bitch if you keep doing that. I do not. Oh, you guys already crushed the mind flare. Take you. Oh, thank you. I never realized you could just jump over this. My character always wants to walk in it anyway. Or I, that works. Watching me. Why is my hand like spasming? Why am I oh, sneaking? What? You guys, you guys have already been here? Richard, uh, there. Richard, can you stay w with the class, please? Are you surprised? Why, did... Why am I sneaking? How do I stop that? Because this is a, oh. a cooperative game, Richard. Do you know what that word means? Richard doesn't yeah. like teamwork. If I stay with the group, I just Another stand step in forward. the background. No. This is why you always end up fucking dead. Uh, I don't remember dying once yet. Open the bloody gate! We're talking about in Nobody this playthrough. We just started. Zevlor's orders. That pack of goblins will be on us any second. <laughs> What's going on? Goblins are on our tail. Open the gate, Zevlor, now. Zevlor. Do you let goblins here? Where yeah. is the druid? Please! There's no time! Ruh -ro. I the nine hells! Right Open the gate! I still think it's unfair how there's not a romanceable goblin. Get him! No! Shit! Form a line! Damnable roach! Provoke the blade! And suffer it sting. So Richard got Gale too then? No, I didn't make it over to Gale. He started complaining, so I turned around. <sighs> In all honesty, I didn't I don't remember where Gale was. <laughs> I don't like Gale. Oh, my ass. It hurts. Your ass? My ass hurts. Mm hmm I'm gonna get you a shirt that says that. That'd be dope. You can wear I it think, to the cat shows. I think booty shorts. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or like those like thigh high socks. That's hot. The Ew. shorts wouldn't look good on me. I don't have a booty to wear. Alright, then the thigh high. Thigh high works for me. Oh, 
who's your favorite romanceable, Rashida? Um, I avoid all of them. Lit. Why? <laughs> um, I don't know. It just makes it really uncomfortable Guys, how, like, get to the insistent they are. Guard the bastard! <laughs> What about you guys? Normally a Starian. Okay. My first playthrough, it was um, Blazel. Oh, and then I kept it as a jet water. <laughs> Withers. Withers is my. <laughs> Withers? No, it is. Oh, yep, man, I love that. I love that jerky, man. <laughs> By sickle and sword, strike them down. <sighs> I'm just kidding. You can't romance with this. I wish you could. <laughs> Carl Ag. Well, whose fault is that? I'm not that far. Just, I had Push. To go. So there is a shirt that exists uh, that says my butt hurts, but it's like two Easter bunnies talking. Like, not Easter bunnies, like chocolate <laughs> Easter bunnies. And one says my butt hurts with a bite out of its butt, and the other one, its ears are bitten off, and it says what? Oh, okay. I love it. Can you heal me, Shadowheart? In quotations. I feel like if it said, um... Thank you. Huh? Instead of okay. what? It would work for Richard. Said it. Maybe say something nice about him. I told him he looked like Anigo Montoya with his mustache. I think that's pretty nice. I'll bleed every last one of you. <laughs> she did tell me I could have the old flashy looks like a girl. And the handlebar mustache. Hell oh, yeah. I can be nice. <laughs> I did, I did call his mustache a not very nice thing because of a. I called it a pedo stash and I was very hurt. <laughs> But wow. I also said that he was a handsome man, so... So, so it even though. Yeah. All the kids would just run right up to you. <laughs> no! Wow. You can't say anything. You're gonna get banned. This fight's going surprisingly well. Mm -hmm. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> nice. Alright, 
I put a message in the chat of this. Voice chat, I mean. I like it. Thank you. It's just the t-shirt that she was describing, chat. Yes. Richard, did you move the big uh, boulder with, um, okay. There's actually so many shirts that says my butt hurts. I should get this one for my dad, though. Hemorrhoids make my butt hurt, and I'm being really brave about it. <laughs> <laughs> I think I should get that for my dad. I'm going to send a picture. His birthday is coming up, to be fair. <laughs> Let's see how far I can jump. Ask me about my hemorrhoids. Pat McCrotch. Nice, cute. <laughs> GG's. Hemorrhoid survivor. These are very interesting. Oh, this is what I get you, Richard. It's my butt hurts, but I'm being really brave about it. Yeah, that's a good one. Or do you want just my butt hurts? It does, honestly, it doesn't matter. I think they're both pretty good. Both so pretty many nice. styles. You gotta find a shirt that says, my ass hurts. Wait, what ass? No. I'd have to make that custom. My mom makes shirts. Maybe I'll have her do it. Maybe I'll have her do it. the last of them. Inside! All of you! More may follow! Open the gate! Alright, you guys gonna do the looting? Loot, 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 loot. I'm gonna go 
inside. Can get through that cutscene. No, I'll wait. I'll wait. Unlike someone I know. Well, I'd rather not see the cutscene. I hate that cutscene. I just want to punch both of them. That's fair. Uh, better than nothing. One later. Better than nothing? I'll do it. I'll, I'll punch him. No, uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, there are children here, you... We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too? Unbelievable! You can cough my payment up now. <laughs> Tell that to the dead at the gate. Shut it, horns! I'd be lying dead next to the goblins if you'd stalled any longer. My duty is to this camp. My oh, duty God forbid is you risk to the Republic. Tale. But I shouldn't be surprised. To democracy. Fold ain't known for courage. You see the tiefling's jaw clench. He's about to erupt. Enough! Squabbling is pointless. The goblins have found us. At least we agree on that. Alright, how much longer are we gonna go for tonight? You never hurt anyone. You always knew what to say. Um when I was homesick. I don't know. No traps, please. What are you guys feeling? I don't work till noon. I also don't work till noon. Tyler, that you worked close. at four. Yeah. Rachita. I don't mind staying up. We do need to get go. Um, Gale and this grove we is kept by Sylvanas's faithful. The boulder outside. Yeah, there's a boulder that a boar leads you to is that right uh, richard uh yeah if you if the boar will hint towards an area and it'll be a boulder that is movable and then it'll uh and then it'll show like a chest and there'll be like a potion and a map mm -hmm. so we don't even know these people that doesn't matter of course it does you would choose strangers over us. That's not what I said. I swear that. Can we stop shouting? No? I'm gonna go talk to the strange cow if we're gonna stay here. I love the strange cow. Do you have an uh, animal? I'm proud of you, kids. No, unfortunately. Ooh, I got an at 20 on it. On the cow? Yeah. Calm down. Please. I won't leave them behind. You're going to get us killed. Can't keep the goblins out forever. And we're no warriors. Just said the creature isn't what it appears to be. Us. Pels, we can't just leave. They're kin. See, kin. Not gamble it our exists. Lives, our futures on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blades and spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. Okay, have fun. Have fun? Yeah, have fun, make friends. Hey, yo. Oh. 
Thank you. It's the right thing to do, and you know it. She's right, Roland. We're better than this. Zerg. Fine, I'll stay too. Lest you both end up with your throat slit by Goblin Blade. Thank you, Roland. Don't be grumpy, Roland. We'll get to the city soon. I am not grumpy. Scowl on your face was quite a troll. <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> uh, guys? Yeah? Can I borrow some money? Some money? What are you looking for? I want to get the uh, gloves of missile snaring. There's some bits and bobs oh, I no longer yeah. need. Those are nice. How much is it? Three fifty-two. Uh, what you got? Money-wise, I have forty-four. I have sixty-five now. I need some some loot. I have stuff I can sell. <laughs> Tyler. Mm -hmm. Also, um, the trader has 425 gold if we want to steal it from him. I can, I can do that, but if we get caught, then what? Well, let's not get caught then. That's a fair I'm point. Just asking if we get caught, what's the plan after? I don't have one. Is it is it just murder our way out of here? Or does it like go to jail? Um, I would I mean I guess we we'd have to murder our way out of here. And then you know, the more the more I'm talking, the less confident I am about this. <laughs> But I think we could do it. One of you has to distract him. Alright. Yeah, I'll talk to him. Okay, let me figure out how to... Should I steal his money, or should I just steal the gloves? I think it has like. Is a, there anything um, you need? Some kind of. Act fast if you do. To show you which one is hard. The ritual will be complete before too oh, long. Oh yeah, this is target. Is that what we're looking at? Yeah, the gloves are easier to steal. Okay. Successful. I pray no goblin like, arrow has- Nettie could put you to left. rights. All right, she should be with the others in the inner- Oh, Hell yeah, free gloves. Hell yeah. This grove is kept by Sylvanas' faithful. Uh. Thieves uh -oh. been emptying pockets around here. I guess you we should might have gotten want to allay some suspicions area. before things get what? out of hand. Because he's questioning me now. Uh oh. I added a bonus. Hey yo! Let's fucking go! You've Lines been given the benefit Lines of the doubt this time, but something tells you next time you won't be so lucky. Yeah. Wait, what? Is he gonna question everyone? You have a convincing air of innocence about you. That's enough for now. A thief's been picking pockets near here. This would be a good moment to explain yourself. Your honesty speaks for itself. It seems you're free to go. Why can't I talk to him? 
He's leaving. Will we scare him off? Oh, he's probably waiting to talk to Richard. Oh. Oh yeah, he's right here. He came back. And again, children, swing. Look who's here. Go on. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Oh, I'm not like you. I don't you. need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Hmm. You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward, and his thoughts become yours. You are the Blade of Frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. You saw her then. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli, a devil's advocate, a champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Her name is Karlak, an archdevil soldier I swore on my good Me. eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying oh, on the Richie. innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Can you make any new friends, like Marin suggested? Yep. First will but be beat. An excellent suggestion, but your party's full up. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. A splendid plan. It. We'll talk more there. So none of us can talk to animals? No. Can't talk to animals yet. Blah, 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 again. Again! Swing, swing, parry, and again! Swing and swing and... Oh. I saw you at the gates. You fight well. A few words for the kids. Spare a story or two. Thanks. I prefer when they smile.
Jason shows off his thunder wave. Depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? <laughs> True. What's up for discussion? I'm talking to a rat. The rat's eyes soften as he emits a pained squeak. You realize the source of his like discomfort. You guys should, um, One of his front teeth is chipped. For the people who just have this on in the background. Ugh. Oh, like me? Yeah, I guess mostly Marin. That's what gluttony, gluttony. Will get you. The rat squeaks in interest. With an enthusiastic chitter, he urges you to follow. I can't follow the rat because the building's locked. Oh, I can unlock it for you. I no, we get in trouble. Well, not if we don't get caught. Lotions and potions for all land. Oh no! no. Might die up here. Those ears are practically Richard. drooping, dearie. Are you harsh? Cold? Feverish? Can we put that on the soundboard? Just <laughs> one of us saying, Richard. Oh, Richard. Oh, Richard. I have a condition, but it's complicated. Oh, I've seen it all. I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. The wife was none too pleased and introduced him to a pot of boiling oil. Oof. But worry not. I fixed him up, and depending on the lighting, he looks good as new. <laughs> My point is... Whatever ails you, I promise I've seen worse. What is it, Petal? What's wrong? Where even are you? Are you still in the camp? Yeah. There's a bugbear in the camp. What? Richard's fighting a bugbear right now. Oh my god. I've got to mind play a parasite As you recount in my head. your adventure, Auntie Ethel nods along, her eyes wide. You poor pet! My heart goes out to you, truly! I see no sign of a tentacle yet, but that could change in an instant. You need help. Serious help. I've ne'er a potion or lotion here that could do it, but... Yes, I may have something at home. Oh, whatever do you mean, Petal? Not at all. Wouldn't have the patience for all that magical drama. I'm a simple woman, sweetie. Tea and potions are as exciting as it gets for these old bones. But enough nattering. I'll be heading home I shortly. Don't have enough movement. Here, let me mark it on your map. Be careful on the road. I'd hate if something happened to you. Take care, Petal. Here, let me try. I am not grumpy. Scowl on your face would frighten a troll. <laughs> You're an idiot. Yay. Nice. So how did a bugbear get in here? Tyler, are you stealing you my coin? Saw you fighting those slimy yeah. bastards. 
Fancy a bowl? Question about the Best to fill your belly now, while we still can. It looks like he was successful. <laughs> Look, it ain't well, much, but it might make all the difference. <laughs> the only way we'll make it to Baldur's Gate is to run, and run hard. If a knoll catches your scent, you'll need every bit of strength. Trust me. Well, I saw a dragon through the telescope. That was pretty cool. <clears throat> True. Doesn't taste all bad. Yeah, we get to see that dragon later. Thanks for fighting off those goblins. If you need to replace any gear, I just ask. Die. My selection's pretty <laughs> slim. I had to leave most of my equipment in Elturel. Let me see your wares. Rimmel Landon. What are you guys doing? We are scrapping. I'm running away from them. Interesting. I'm coming for you. Getting pushed. No, I'm not. You're so mean. <laughs> Getting pushed. I'm just a girl. No. Equality. <laughs> <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Uses wooden tools. Can it? At my fill, I suppose. I promise I won't no. put you. <laughs> I <don't> like this. <laughs> Is Richard causing chaos? No. no. He's threatening no. me. No. No way. I think I'd make a fine teacher. How many people are young enough to ask? I don't oh, trust you. Sure. No, no. Sure. No. Um, right. gotcha. <laughs> We're exposed now. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Only one person can push Rashida. <laughs> and we'll have a dog, right? They don't allow them wow. in Baldur's Gate. <laughs> Cats, though. I've seen that. A little orange cat. Oh, and a house with it. a little door so that it can come and go as it pleases. And a high fence to keep eavesdroppers out. Ooh, I, there's stuff happening behind this door if you want to come. Don't mind me. I was just passing through. No bother. We're just daydreaming anyhow. What about you? Big plans for when you get to the city? I'll be seeking the warmth of the Elf Song Tavern. I think I've heard of that place. Something about a stuffed dragon's head in one of the dining rooms. It's settled, Dannis. You, me, and the Elf Song Tavern first thing when we arrive. If we see you there, we'll get you a pint. For your finder's fee. Whose fault is that? Your Richard. You, you, you're the one who started the damage. 
I was a dick. You started it. You you were like, I'm gonna push you. I am not. That doesn't hurt me. No helping it. We're exposed now. Doesn't matter. It still it hurt it hurt me emotionally. <laughs> My emotions are hurt. Always room for more. Auntie Ethel might have some potions. Something's sure off. That. This creature isn't what yeah, it appears to be. Anyway. I'm a, I mean, I'm out of spells anyway, so we could long rest. Do we all need to be in like the same general? In vicinity? the camp, yes. <clears throat> no, the party leader needs to uh, keep the goblins out forever. Oh, are we long resting? Yeah. Someone didn't accept it. I'm not in the camp. How do you feel? Yes, me as well. Besides the occasional mental exchange, it's almost as if we're not infected. Oh, we I think it lays out. Good. It's so strange. No, Do you remember the voice it. aboard the ship? After they put that tadpole in my eye, I heard this voice. It was soothing. The voice said I'd become a beautiful weapon. What do you think that Get means? Away from me. Stop. If I killed you in camp, would you die, die, Richard? I think so, I yes. Would be down. Sounds like it had plans for us. Whatever they were, those plans Anybody were interrupted by the dragon. Yes. Either way, we can't take the lack of symptoms for granted. We have to find a healer. Well, I've said my piece. Get some rest. Need something? Oh, what's to tell? Oh, I'm a to magistrate everyone. back in the city. It's all rather tedious. I'm done. Probably Tyler. Probably Tyler, yeah. Are you jealous, Richard? A little bit. So jealous. I'm so purple. You're very purple. So, 
What else are we doing in camp? Need something? How much we can do in camp right now. So let's go get Gail. We uh, should get a uh, Lazelle too. Mm -hmm. Or do you want to? We can start the druid thing and then just get them like on the way. Okay. And then we can. We'll do. We'll get Carlac and Gale, and then we can go get the owl bear. And then go to goblins, I guess. Uh, I think Oizel is closer than Carlac. Yeah, I'm sorry. I meant Lazel. Yeah. I get my good. strong ladies confused. Okay, I'm at the stone door. Uh, which stone door? It's the. Uh... You know where you talk to the rat? Yes. Well, you can see me on the map. Oh, down near there? Mm-hmm. Gotcha. Change the color of my outfit. Oh, yeah, I bought dye. I should do that, too. Again. You, if you go to your traveler's chest, there's five... I don't want crimson. Make one up. See? My robe is red now. As if you could tell, Richard. Hmm. Richard's colorblind, you guys. That's fair. That's true. Yes. Please, last room. Yeah, we took a you knew this, that. Tyler. Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn. Mary's also. And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back. Oh, let me through, Radrashev, or I'll rip your damn throat out. I'm saying you don't know if that looks cool or not. I'm waiting for Marinto. Until we open the door. Oh, you can go ahead. But like, you're the one. We need to get Arabella out oh, yeah. now. You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give work. I'd sooner trek through the nine hells than trust that Ooh. snake. Ugh. Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. They need it for their precious ritual. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear, or better yet, explode. Now Arabella's being judged by a bunch of druids who hate. Thank you. Hurry! I'm at the end of my tether as is. I don't really want to see Lord Farquaad naked. Yeah, I'm good. Then don't come back to the stone door. And by you. Swing. Oh no. Oh no. Miranda. <laughs> Eric's dream's gonna get taken down for obscenity. <laughs> Can you put some clothes on, please? Just. We need to cover him up. <laughs> Stop staring at me. Don't be grumpy, Rodan. Okay. Oh my god, Richard. Let's just go. We'll leave him, Rashida. Ah. You. Thank you. You stopped us from making a bad situation much worse. I'm Marin. Well met. Though I should warn you, visitors are no longer welcome in this grove. Whatever your business here, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This latest attack will only strengthen the I don't know why I, I immediately went for a British accent. But I did. 
Why are they forcing you out? There have been several attacks by different monsters. The druids blame us outsiders for drawing them here. Because Nobody's all of them welcome have a anymore. They've started a ritual to cut the grove mm -hmm. off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We are no fighters. This ritual. Is there no way to convince the druids to stop it? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't see me. You, though. I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her. For more time to prepare, if nothing else. I'll see what I can do. We owe you a great debt. If we're forced to leave now, more of my people will die. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense. Richard, no, what the fuck? But if there's a clear path past those goblins, they'll find it. Yes. Of course. Can't wait to get out again. We're exposed now. Richard, are you still naked? I'm wearing underwear. I hope the goblins aren't Easy. smart enough to poison their blade. My PP put away. Do I want to know why there's blood out here? Uh, you just say Rashida shot me. Hmm. He stares right past you, as if you're invisible. Or boring. Mm-hmm. Mm. He's still staring right past you. <laughs> you I see nothing out of the ordinary. Here. As you turn back, the I child slips between the rocks. That wasn't me. That's what they all say. You find the edges of a concealed entrance. That's what she said. <laughs> uh oh. Magrin, give her a chance. You, get back! I'm not looking for trouble. No, Can you just let me and you'll die? find trouble all the same unless you get out of my sight. A moment, Giona. What? Oh, I understand. You! Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. Ah, my good... You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Fine. Ask your questions. Glory. Now then. How would you describe that particular batch of goblins? <gasps> Size, nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Goblins were of a rare jam colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? There's dragon blood in my veins. I'd know if one of my forebears had been there. 
witness believes herself to be Dragon, possibly deluded. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the Absolute when they fell upon the gates? Yes, they called out the name like a war cry. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one, a captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglabiot, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Never you mind. I'm on my way to their camp as we speak. I always knew my studies in Kukliak would come to some use. Be careful. Goblins aren't known for their mercy. Oh, never you mind. Who needs mercy when you've a quick tongue, hmm? Huh? And an invisibility potion stashed in your back pocket. What key? Until we meet again. Hey, you went on a whole adventure. What are you doing, Richard? Speak. What were you saying to that the bird? The bird knows. She needs to know. You do not. I don't think that uh, I helped defend this grove. I'm not your enemy. You, I fear. It is my brethren. More follow Korga every day. They are afraid, and she offers a simple solution. Eject the refugees, and we will be safe. Sounds like she has to be stopped. How do we do that? A druid and an outsider. We can do nothing without turning the others against us. Only Master Halsin can stop this. I pray my bird returns with news of him. If not, I fear for my people. What happened to Halsin? He left with the adventurers. They went treasure hunting in an old temple near here. Master Halsin did not chase treasure. I do not know what he was chasing. But he never returned. I hear a ritual can protect the grove. Are you helping prepare it? I would prefer not to. But if Master Halsin does not return, Korga will give the order. And my voice will not matter. Richard, did you move the bear? Yeah, I talked to the bear next to it. I'm in the stone door. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm coming. Have you lost your senses, Koga? Release her. She stole the idol of Sylvana. She must pay the price. Snack. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Koga. She's just a a what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? 
I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Imprison her? She's just a child. She's a parasite. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Release her. I'll see that she stays out of trouble. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ayo! <laughs> Very well. She may go. Break your word, and my serpent shall feed. Sif, sif, Tila to me. Out, thief. Sif, sif. My grace has its limits. Thank you, Korga. Master Holsen. Halsen isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. What a bitch. I'm just gonna say the same thing. Come here. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? You're protecting your own. Sometimes cruelty is required. First you urge grace, then you speak truth. You surprised me twice over. A shame the grace period ends. The viper's fangs have been bared. She must guard her brood. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. Zevlor believes his people will perish on the road. And mine perish if he stays. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Zevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Then it seems I best speak to Zevlor. You will do more than speak. Ooh. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. <clears throat> Why my character go that way? What am I doing? Does that hurt? I see you. Just give me a moment. This medicatrix. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now. What was it you needed? You found her. But I still don't know what she can do for you. Do you know anything about mind flayers? Why are you asking? Don't tell her. Why? I don't trust her. You don't trust her? I trust her. No good way of putting this. I uh, have a tadpole in my head. A tadpole? A mind flare tadpole. A mind flare tadpole. Tell him you don't trust someone with an accent like that. <laughs> <laughs> you know of them. Can you help me? I. Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. 
We need to be quick. This way. Head on in. Yay, Richard put on clothes. There's something in that vessel. Take a closer look. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. So you killed him and laid him out on the table. Good night, Megan. No. That was Master Halson. A pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. You don't have to be here for this, all right? Let's see what we can do. Thank you. I'll take anything that can help. Of course. Now, tell me what's been happening. Any symptoms? Strange events? I can merge my mind with anyone else that's infected. Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How'd you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. <laughs> she is sus. I've heard. On a mind flayer ship. I was kidnapped and defected. A and mind infected. flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. Okay, I stole everything. You deserve a chance to oh save yourself. Oh my god, yourself. Richard. <laughs> this is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. I swear. I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hell was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. What do you mean, should be changing? Mind flayers reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms and a new mind flayer is born. The thing in your skull, though? It's different to anything in our records. It's one of their worms, for sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. You said you were tracking other victims. Did they change? Hard to say, but there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna, and I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers, joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. You think he's still alive? I think so. I hope so. 
I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halston and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? All right. I'll find Halston. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Take it one step at a time, Nettie. Come on. There was something in a vial here. Yeah. It was uh, a worm, I think. Did one of you take it already? Richard? I didn't touch it. I didn't take it. Uh oh. I took it. I got a letter off the drow. Um, I don't remember what it says. It says, track the druid, find whatever burrow he runs to, and report back to me. Remember, you are only a scout. Do not engage. Do not kill anyone. Simply observe and return. I shall decide what we do next. And it's signed, M. Huh. Oh, I left. Where are we going now? I, wish I, could understand you. I was going up to the bard lady up here. that tune you're singing more like butchering don't know why i bother are you all right no i'm moments away from a grisly death at the hands of this bloody song i can't nothing fits you know let me see if i can help hmm it can't hurt. I have her. I have an extra loot, if you want. First things first. What's the song about? My teacher, Lihala. She loved dancing. Had two left feet, mind. I remember waking up one night on the road and seeing her dancing beneath the stars. A huge smile on her face. Thinking of it now. Does anyone have my heart hurts. No. And my words just seem to crumble. Like ash. Wait. No. Words of mine will turn to There's ash. There's a locked chest. That's perfect. Um, in here. Where is it? It's, um. Uh, Keep going. You know the. What would you say to your teacher in, if she were here right now? The uh, snake lady that is. In that it's room okay. With, um, that I'll yeah. be okay. Oh. And yeah. thank you. In the room with the uh, glowing bear statues. All right. That's Up what your lyrics here. need to say. Moon. And then behind. Moon reminds me of your grace. All the love I can't repay. Wait. I 
I'm gonna go find some uh, these tools. Maybe one of the um, traders are selling it. What are you what are you doing, Richard? Run away. <laughs> what are you running from? I'm running. From a man. What'd you do? Named Steve. Wait, wait, wait. It's accused me of stealing now. Yeah, they ask all of us. No, but like I have to like roll or pay gold. Oh, he didn't do it. Careful talking to these people, Rashida. This kid's gonna come up on you and try to take off you. I'm just looking for these tools, man. So someone did. Someone stole something. Sorry. From, the from what? Mm-hmm. Catch him. Someone stole what? Where are they? That song is beautiful. Kid, he's running away. Worthy of a few tears. <laughs> Thanks. That's the first Where? time I've played since Lihala died. Taco's almost empty. Well, are you gonna get him, or...? She was playing her loot. She's just gonna stand there. You want me to kill a kid? Didn't hear the noise coming. He went into the hideout. There was so much blood. Uh, Where is the hideout? I can still smell it. we went into earlier? This one over here. Sounds terrible. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm going down. What did he steal? Sure your teacher would be proud to see you I have you no now. idea, but I want it back. <laughs> She'd yell at me for that clunky verse. And make me play till my fingers were raw. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Finish the Weeping Dawn. For her. I have a long way to go. But thank you. I, I needed this. The road to Baldur's Gate looks a little less daunting now that we're all back together. Yes, yes, I see. I guess that. Uh, you get that stole from you in curly hair. What are you guys doing? I'm trying to get back my stuff. I got robbed. I've been robbed. He doesn't go you down here. You said he came here. He did, but I can't see. I don't see him anywhere. <clears throat> he 
This is where you would get your stolen. You're not today. supposed to be here. I don't even know what he's. You don't about. look so tough. Mole fought off a hobgoblin all by herself. Well, I didn't even have that much gold in the first place. You're the first grown up who's ever gotten in here. Not bad. This guy's got curly hair. But he's not giving me anything. Oh, All right, no. well. We've got trouble! Anybody have Misty oh. stuff? Uh, no. I don't think they took anything I care about. You can't be, be here! This is our hideout! It was just a matter of principle. We're gonna kill them all. You can't be here! This is our <laughs> no, hideout! <laughs> No, we can we can murder these kids. I'm cool with that. <laughs> Not a chance. I'll <laughs> and fit in there. their bodies. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll get back, get back that gold. I think they they probably just stole like fifty gold More? or something. We've got trouble. You can't be here. This it's not worth it. Fifty gold. That that's a lot. That was an estimate too. That's worth the life of a. Uh, that's for child. Boys. Eight, eight children, fifty gold. I'm just trying to open that uh, chest that uh, Richard stole. If he puts it down, I got. I cannot put it down in the Let's do. Everybody. Let's do it at camp. Yeah, let's go to camp real quick. Refugees, okay. adventurers, and even a drow. No one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met, and thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Mm. Act fast if you do. Put it down, Richard. The ritual will be complete before too long. Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Alright. Alright, um, one of you has guidance, right? Yeah. Tyler. Sylvanas, guide your path. I don't know if I need it. Looking ahead. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think that did anything, but... Alright. Barely made it. Kaga's chest. Onyx. What was the book? So, the book is Baldorn's Canticle, The Shadow Druid's Doctrine. Oh. And, um, she got a- there's a- there was a letter in the chest, too. I'm gonna read the half-torn note. The marks crisscrossing the page don't look scribed so much as slashed. It says, Kaga, Swamp Docks, three, meet me alone. Oh, it says tree, not three. Um, and then it's signed, Aladdin. Swamp Docks, Tree. Okay. Mm. Um, and the book. The book's spine is limber from overuse. The corner of one page is folded inwards. The page says, balance is a myth. Where any clan treads, nature struggles. Unity is a fiction. Men of mere flesh seek only to tame beast and raise flora. We are the thunder and we are the rain. We shatter mankind and grow new life in its place. Well, hello. What can I do for you? Hey. Ooh, you got an inspiration. Alright. Let's get, uh, Lazelle and Gale. Let's get Gale Zell. Right, Gazel. Gazel. I'm fast traveling to the Emerald Grove environs. Mm -hmm. I don't remember.
remember where Gale is. Isn't it like right here? Tyler, do you remember? Yeah, it's too late, Delford. Okay, I have good charisma, so I can probably bullshit my way through this. Alright. Zoru was right. Yellow is a toad, and twice as ugly. The thing's dangerous. Leave it for the goblins to kill. And if it escapes, how will you... Oh, a guest. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white-hot stare. Her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. This creature is dangerous. Get out of here. Leave it to me. Oh. Oh, hell yeah. She's right. Let's go. We need to check out that blast. A blast? I could use more specifics. Shook our camp good, so we came for a look. I'm in dire need of this... of healing. Where is this camp? Northwest. Look for Nettie. Whatever your wound, she can mend it. And be careful. There are goblin traps everywhere. Nymessa, come. Enough gawking. Get me down. Never. Where's the rope for it? Observe and listen. You hear Enough goblins talking. Get me down. As you say. Can you not just shoot it? Oh, you can. The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You, you will join me. Let's get Gale. I want to get Gail. Um. Break it is many break. things. A hatchery, a training grounds, a shelter. Githyanki protocol is clear. When infected with a, a hatchery, tadpole, we must report to Augusta for purification. Yeah, the they hatch from eggs. Githyanki hatch from eggs. Yeah. yeah. A simple thank you wouldn't go amiss. You may as well suggest a wyvern bow to worms. The cure I offer will suffice as thanks. Uh-oh, Simon's screaming. All right, we journey together. Let's find this crash. You are full up. Dismiss your weakest warrior. All right. <laughs> Wait at my camp. We can speak there. Very well, but heed my words. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. Tyler, do One you hear there, Simon? This Zoril has yeah. seen Githyanki. A crash must Simon be near. Says I must interrogate this Zoril. Our very lives depend on it. I will be oh, at your mother. camp. Do not keep Simon me waiting. Simon says my wow. All right, let's get Gale and then we'll be done. Where's that Gale? Good. Uh, so. Oh my god, he's screaming, dude. Is this it? Yeah. Okay. Moran, are you here? Uh, yes. What's going on with the room? You are unable to Stop speak. Stop it. Somehow. Is he? You are unable to speak.
approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. Oh, there's a hand. A hand? Anyone? No, just goodbye, bro. I'm gonna grab his hand. I ground this. What? What the hell? Oh, you really don't like him. Um. What's this? How, how do you sabotage a sigil? Try it. No. Just your average traveler stuck between realms. Dude, his voice. Out, we'll get properly introduced. <laughs> he like sounds like voice. an incel. Like, he sounds like he's gonna. He's gonna <sighs> malady you? Yeah. Okay. And then tell you that women belong in the kitchen. With a keen but calculated twist, I attempt to sabotage the sigil. Yo. Hey, yo! Whatever you're doing is working wonders! Now a quick little pull should do the trick! Whenever uh -huh. I hear lines like that, I always think of the voice actors grunting in a studio. Yeah. I literally hear Tyler in the background. Oh. Oh. Hello. I'm Gale of Waterdeep. Apologies. I'm usually better at this. At magic. And introductions. Say, but I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking. You were on the Nautiloid as well. Uh, never mind the Nautiloid. How did you get stuck in that stone? I don't know what transpired exactly, but the ship broke into pieces and I suddenly found myself in freefall. Tyler, Simon's I still was screaming. plummeting to certain death. I spied a glimmer quite near All right, after we send him to camp, to I gotta go. Less than savory propulsion. All right. Recognizing this glimmer to be magical in nature, I reached out to it with a weaving of words and found myself like on the other earring. side as it were how about you that is cool how did you survive the fall to be honest i don't have a clue fair enough <laughs> but even so like I have he's pretty suspicion your but like his voice very much and his personality back on the ship you ugly. two were on he's the receiving end of a rather unwelcome oh, insertion not. in the ocular region are you not couldn't have phrased it more repellently myself. No, you sugarcoating it, is there? The insertee we speak of, this parasite. Are you aware that after a period of Stop pushing each other. gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers? It's a process known as ceramorphosis, and let me assure you, it is to be avoided. You don't happen to be a cleric by any chance, do you? You can't hit me with a doctor, surgeon. Uncannily adroit with a knitting needle. I am actually <laughs> uncannily adroit with a knitting needle. Um, I'm no stranger to high stakes extractions, but these tadpoles are beyond even my light fingers. I can't. Cure I suppose few enough can. Not exactly a common. Can you affliction. guys hear Simon through We're the mic? We're certainly going to need a healer. I cannot. And soon too. Definitely. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more and look for a healer together? Sounds like a plan. You're welcome to join me. Oh. I see you're traveling with plenty of company already. Perhaps I can join you later instead. I'll make my way to your camp and embark upon a succulent slow cook to be consumed upon oh, your return. Succulent. All right, log off or level up? Leveling up. Uh, level up, log off. Now have animals Nice. Um, oh, I get to choose a subclass. I can be a thief, an arcane trickster, or an assassin. I think I'm gonna be an assassin. Cause, uh, Marin's already got the magic, right? Yeah. And, uh, Richard's gonna do all the stealing with her. He's built for it or not. 
<laughs> Glad we understand. I can cast spells while silenced. Cool. All right, logging off. Same. <laughs> I want that as a sound. The soundboard. Richard. Richard. Simon says no more. I'm done. Log it off. All right, Tyler, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Handle the boy. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> guys got a soundboard in here. <laughs> okay. Oh, hell yeah. I don't think anybody... Oh, there's two people watching. Damn. Okay, well. Good night, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye, everyone. Um, we'll see y'all later. Oh. Bye. <laughs>